Hi friends, hope you all are enjoying today. Philippians 2.13 says, For it is God who works in you, both to will and to do for His good pleasure. More than once, Ellen White told God that she wanted to give up her God-appointed task. She was naturally shy and physically weak. She asked God several times to take the work from her and give it to someone else. How could she go before grown men who were leaders and tell them that she, a girl of 17, had received vision from God? Would they believe her? She reasoned. But God asked her to tell others concerning the vision she had received. God promised to give her strength to do His work. His angels would minister to her. It was a wonderful promise and Ellen was greatly encouraged. Still, she felt fear and uncertainty and she went forth to do God's work but these soon vanished for she was given strength she could do what God had required of her there were times when she was tired or sick but she was refreshed by obeying God's command this was, this was one of the most wonderful things about keeping God's command. We receive strength when we obey them. Even when temptations threaten, God has a way of escape for us. Paul knew this to be true when he said, I can do all things. To Christ who strengthens me. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego found that God was right there with them when danger threatened. So, dear believers, when you and I walk in God's will through obedience, He fights for us. Take heart today. As you follow God's leading through obedience, knowing great rewards are waiting, God desires to be our strength. All that we have to ask Him, all that He tells us to do, is to obey and trust Him. Remember, we cannot obey if we do not trust that what He has in store for us is a mighty blessing and to make us a blessing. Let us ask God to give us His vision through obedience. May we seek the Holy Spirit in all things, thanking Him for His adornment of a new heart of obedience. With your obedience and mine, others will see Christ's love and mercy furthering God's kingdom. May God bless you.